All right, Nick Feldman, 16U Greco Roman champion. How do you feel? Uh, I mean, I'm pretty happy with it. I would have liked to be up there in freestyle too, but Greco, yeah, that's why you do both, I guess. So you took third in freestyle, so it's still a pretty good performance, but you're yeah. not happy with it? No, I mean, my semis match was close. I just didn't, didn't get there quite, wasn't quite good enough in one position, but I'll take one title, I guess. It's pretty good. Um, so, really tight match up until the end when you get the, the two points when he's kind of going for a desperation throw and then you get one more from the failed challenge. But, you know, basically a 1-1 match. Talk about how tough it is to grind out a win like that and what you have to do to stay focused to, to win that match. Yeah, I mean, it's mostly just about keeping position the whole match. It's Greco, it's not really about a lot of throws. It's about kind of keeping your elbows tight, close position, wrists and drags. And it's just wrestling smart, basically. So, uh, you know, that was a dog fight, and you're not even breathing hard right now, really. Like, yeah. talk, talk about your conditioning and the kind of shape you're in. Um, I mean, I've always kind of been trying to keep my conditioning up a lot. I like to lift weights a lot, so, you know, I mean, I do, I had a practice every day, I do some sprints, and some sprints in my house, my treadmill, and some pillows, that kind of thing, but anything to keep the conditioning up so you can keep those tight matches good. Uh, so Pennsylvania prides itself being a wrestling state. Yeah. You know, most people, yes, best wrestling state in the country. Uh, I'm full disclosure. I'm from Pennsylvania, so I'm a little biased. <laughs> but uh, uh, can you talk a little bit about representing Team PA and the pride that comes with that? Yeah, I've been. I moved to Pennsylvania about two and a half, three years ago, and it's. I mean, it's, it is. A, it's a heavy weight to carry on your shoulders. That just everyone knows the Team PA. They're scared of them, and you got a target in your back. Just everyone wants to take them down and. It's just, it's a really big honor to be wrestling for Team Pennsylvania. I really love it. Yeah. Um, so, where, what state did you move from? I used to live down in Virginia Beach area, I think, down in Virginia. Okay. Was it a move specifically for wrestling, or it just happened? Wrestling was a really big part of it. My dad was in the Navy, and he retired. And, I mean, he got a job up there, and we realized that the wrestling up there is going to be so much better and just more beneficial to me overall. So it was not a bad choice, I think. Do you think you've improved a lot since moving? I think I've made huge jumps up from where I was, but yeah. All right, so now you got a, a title under your belt. Uh, what do the next six months look like for you? Um, I'll probably be taking the next month or so off just to lift and try to get bigger. And then, you know, whatever way I end up not next year, I'll just hope to get more titles. That kind of thing, just training all the fall and, you know, not really resting until the season, probably in big tournaments. All right, so Greco freestyle folk, what's your favorite? Um, I like freestyle the best out of all of them. Just, I really like doing leg attacks a lot, and, but they're all pretty cool, I think. Wrestling is wrestling. All right, anything else? Uh, nope, I mean, I think my mom, she uh, helped me a lot. She's really a big health nut, and I think it helped me a lot to stay in good shape. And mm -hmm. my dad just trained me. That's about it. All right, congratulations. All right, thank you very much.